Thyroid nodule is a common problem in a young population, particularly affecting young women. Uh, these usually produce, uh, you know, when they are in increased in size, they produce a compressive symptoms or uh, they might be of a cosmetic concern and sometimes overproduce the thyroid hormone. Until recently, uh, the uh, standard of treatment for uh, thyroid nodules was uh, when it is not controlled through medications, uh, was through a surgical approach uh, where they do a thyroidectomy. Uh, around 25 to 30 percent of the patients who undergo thyroidectomy would require a lifelong replacement of uh, thyroxine. If you are not looking for a surgical approach or some patients who have got medically comorbid conditions or unfit for surgery, uh, radiofrequency ablation of thyroid nodule is an alternative and uh, uh, proven and effective treatment for thyroid nodules as basically non-surgical, minimally invasive, scarless and virtually no blood loss where the only the abnormal thyroid tissue is targeted so that the thyroid is preserved and your thyroid functions are retained. In radiofrequency ablation, uh, we use a needle like probe which is around 2 mm, 1 to 2 mm. So that needle is inserted into the abnormal thyroid nodule. So then the radio frequency waves are sent to it which ablates, I mean which heats up the abnormal thyroid nodule and then that undergoes necrosis and uh, the nodule being heated up and then the necrosis is continuously monitored on ultrasound. Most nodules show a substantial volume reduction over a gradual period of time. Um, we have seen around in six months of time, the nodule is almost 80 percent, uh, you know, the size is reduced. And some nodules which are very big might require an additional treatment. Uh, radiofrequency ablation of thyroid nodule is a safe, effective and proven treatment. Uh, basically, there is virtually no blood loss and no scars and uh, no requirement of general anesthesia. Recovery is rapid, usually patient gets discharged in a day or two and you may not require lifelong thyroxine therapy unlike in surgery and it preserves your thyroid gland and its functions. Uh, radiofrequency ablation has already been used to treat uh, in other parts of the body such as liver cancer and kidney cancers uh, wherein we send in the radiofrequency waves and then that heats up the tumor part and then that undergoes necrosis.